everyone welcome back i'm winter and it is april 12th of 2024 thank you guys for being here so early on hopefully you've had a good day so far and hopefully it's about to get just a little bit better today we're playing starcraft with commentary thank you uh s reaver sc2 for 69 months N nicely done uh since we're last year Luna Light, Sketchy Kitty, OG Peace TV, um, Insertius, Protoss, Lead, you still enjoy. Um, today, no, there's nothing special. It's same, but new day. At least somebody will play. And somebody, it's probably me, but. Otherwise, no good news, no bad news, regular news, okay, I can subscribe.
Thank you, Aardvark. One eleven, forty-eight months. Great, he's telling you. The Curse Gazak shirt. In a nutshell, maybe. We're gonna make marines more than likely. But not, I mean, mech is fine, but marines are even better. Gas though. Oh, 
I bounced a ling it. That's crazy. Alone. Research. Will do. Cannot build there. 
Add on. Operational. Mineral cluster expended. I'm on it. This... What? Looking for answers. Let's be ready. Ready for dust off. Go, go, go! Ready for dust off.
Thankfully, I don't need to micro if I can macro. Which is, uh, we can be very thankful for. Oh, what a disaster. Holy fuck. Yeah, well... I don't think at any point he had more workers. I moved commanded into the Hydras. And then I ran right over the lurkers. I did everything I could to make that a loss. Yeah, even when I pulled SCVs, I was up 20 workers. But. Marines and upgrades. Oh. Eventually Marauders too. I still use Ghost if you don't want Micro. It's not that I don't want Micro, it's that I can't. There's a difference. Should I never try to run if I've never learned to walk? Baza just donated $10. Gumi versus Stuff Match Up. First game Gumi have kept building tanks that seemed to hurt him more than help. I am not they questioning didn't. him. I am just curious as to I'm why not he questioning him. Swarm since it seemed bats and clones I'm not hitting you, bro. I'm just... Allowing my fist to connect with your face. Not enough minerals. Because what else are you gonna build? Well, it's because Gumio has principles, which is why he lost that game. Those principles are don't build ghosts because that just kind of counters everything. It's 
So either you build ghosts or you die trying is usually how it goes. The best unit for Mech Terran is the Goat, which is also somewhat coincidentally the best unit for Bio Terran. Again, sir. Ghosts are even pretty good against, like, Locusts, because, uh, Locusts are light units. Ghosts, I think, two-shot? I'm pretty sure it's not one-shot with plus three, but it's possible. Who knows, right? Who knows? <laughs> mathematicians. The only mathematicians out there are Terrans. All right, and they're not going to tell you. Stalker kick.
I don't understand this magic at all. I think I tried to play too normal after the start. Yeah, he just had more. I mean, I guess it's simple enough. Getting to the point where it's such a disparity 
between like I have 60 almost 70% win rate is Terran, 65% is Zerg, and 40% is Protoss. So once the disparity gets too great as a random player, well, most people don't play enough games to really figure that out, but like you're left with two choices. One is just kind of mostly accept the Protoss losses or try to shore it up individually. Typical TVZ build. Because if it gets too large a disparity, essentially you're favored to win with Terran and Zerg, and then you just get um, run over as Protoss. Or vice versa. Well, not really vice versa. That's usually the trend. Like, I How do you have 36 wins be number 12 on the letter? Because um, that rank 12 means nothing. Barcode GM Proof Toss. Beautiful. I should still treat your OMR separately by race, even if you random? Yeah, dozens of us would be affected. Dozens! There are dozens! Did you know we're already affected by the bug that show like, it doesn't show your MMR on the load screen? But only Masters Plus shows MMR on the load screen. And since there are several dozen Masters Random and GM Random players, dozens of us! That has been a bug since they added MMR. Uh, visible. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. This is incredibly greedy, but we're going for it. Because you won't necessarily know to punish it. And on, on this map, I think you gotta take some chances. moves there to go for two gates blind
fucking hate plans are. We gotta try to guess when the uh, oracle comes in. I don't want to build. Doesn't have to be an oracle, but. You can't just not build spores. Should easily be mass adept, in which case the spores are entirely useless. I guess at least it's all this. I do not want to have this be the choke point though. Jesus. a real life immortal.
Mineral cluster expended. Mineral field exhausted. Mineral field depleted. More minerals. Mineral field exhausted. Mineral field depleted. Mineral cluster ex not enough. Mineral quantity insufficient. Insufficient mineral Mineral command unacceptable. Command unacceptable. Command unacceptable. Evolution complete. Swarm has evolved. What a potato. Unfortunately, I can still very much lose this or throw it. A lot of options there. Creep tumor under attack. Swarm forces under attack. Creep tumor under I don't have nearly enough drones at the moment. And the carriers are likely on the way. Swarm has evolved. Mineral quantity insufficient. More. Swarm forces under insufficient overlords. Swarm forces under direct or overlord. We've got a mothership on it. That's what's happening there. Lurker sucks so hard. Yeah, I've lost. beat that army once you lose a fight it's so hard to bring your army back together I just went right down the center can't just come up that ramp, like... All my tech was up there, too. Oh, 
Including my Hydra Den, like... <laughs> Did he have anything? Attack. Kidding me. Oh, come on. All I had to do was not move command. I tried to move command just the Bane Link. Classic mistake, trying to micro. 125 APM, low APM challenge. God. I don't think I win the fight, even if it was a perfect engagement there. I didn't have enough drones. I killed the army, but remember that game against Zerg, where he had a bunch of Hydras, and he won every fight? When I was Terran. And then I won the war. Because if you ever run out of Zerg units, you just kind of lose everything. Is there a master in our hearts is in you uh master in out hearts as well. More minerals required. Um thank you. Enough minerals. 
Hopefully it is a good string. What's going on? Ready. 
I don't know enough of this game to say something. Has that ever stopped you before?
do one of them. Just gamble. I think they'll go conservative blink. He suspects Stargate, so he's gonna have stalkers in position. So I'm gonna do something very dumb, but also super smart because it's so dumb. Which is just walk up and see if I can do a bunch of damage. For free. Probably should just take down the mineral wall. Otherwise, it's gonna get used against me. Not. 
I return to serve. Teleport successfully. <laughs> How many minerals? So far behind. Yeah, 20 probes. I knew we were winning too much last time. Well, it's not five, it's four. The first game did not start off well. I'm done with the barcodes. It's not it's not happening today. Barcode Protoss, regular Protoss, casual Protoss, complain about Protoss. If only Protoss didn't have such units that were so great against players that were so terrible. Maybe we end up with some low APM, but this isn't. Well, we'll see. Yeah. All right. I'm just going to build. Marauders, maybe some Marines, but I don't like sitting here seething. 
because I'm so incompetent. It's not upset at balance. It's not upset at like, anything in particular besides general incompetence. It's like, well, I'm ne not playing as well as I could. And I'm not even playing as well as I know I could, even when I'm not playing well. Which makes sense in my head. But there's no fixing it. There's kind of altering it, but... Some days. I've played enough days to know. I've played most of the days of the last 14 years. How many SC2 games? 50 to 60,000? Doesn't stop me from miss my ring my SCVs. It's like, now that you've perfected a skill, how is it that you mess it up still? That's a good question. Alright. Just like when you perfect running a marathon, and then you don't keep training, you'll be able to run a marathon at exactly the same pace. Five years from now. What the fuck is he doing? Alright. I think he was like right clicked or on something, but it didn't quite take something like that. He's going to do some fuckery. I have to come back. Yeah. You finish the CC at least. Making sure he doesn't have anything else. That's yeah, gonna be blink timing. Should be an observer. Wait, I don't have a scan. Mm. 
No, other way. He didn't have an observer because he went for this. Stay. the risk First round. SCV. 방물을 다 썼는데 우리 지는 거 아니죠? Go ahead. 네. Ready for dust off. 
자나깨나 가스 조심 언제까지 보급고 막힐래요? You want a piece of me, boy? Outstanding oh. good song. Go ahead, huh? We could use some help here. It's about SCB ready. Let's have a blast. 도속검 거긴 못 내립니다. 아래 뭐가 있나 본데요? 업그레이드 완료. 너무 미치는 마세요. 설마 확장 지진이 있죠? 방물이 없는데 자꾸 일만 시킬래요? Marauders. Stop with the ghosts. Go surfer. Having micro. Six split versus the disruptor. Yeah, that's what people focus on. Makes me look good despite having 25 marauders of minerals in the bank. But those splits though. Just like when Cure gets slammed by like three disruptors and people think he's bad and then he still has the 40 supply lead. He also plays Terran. Yeah, but he doesn't play Terran in the way that makes you feel like a pro gamer. He plays Terran in like a clocking in nine to five. 
making sure every uh, we don't get inefficiency in the production queue. What can Protoss do when Medivac uh, when Terran just gets in Medivac and jumps base to base? Um, they should have considered uh, leaving 20 supply of stalkers in every base. And also getting good. Maru showed cure. Well, the problem in TVT is, especially against Maru, it's not like good macro is not going to solve the problem. Because they have the same units. Especially when it comes down to like ravens. Game is hard. You can tell, like, the, the, usually the minerals don't slip up there like that. Like, 1500, 2500. That's the indicator to me that's going poorly, more than anything else. Usually, when I'm playing okay, not great, not terrible. It's, I don't have any minerals, but I'm supply blocked. The supply block is, is marginally better, because at least you're trying to spend your money. It's kind of arguable on that, but but when you're when the minerals get up there, it just means you're not even bothering. Like, uh, at least you built workers, I guess. That's the laziest version. does that why what if I just had a second reaper I did it when they play dumb. Throws me off. Not smart. We're gonna try it. Yes, 
전에 장검이 필수. Go ahead. 에너지 타령 모드 업그레이드 완료. Why don't you take a seat over here? Stuck? How? Help me step tank. Oh my god. Not like that. Neither do I, but... Bad news. What's going on? At least we're even. Come 
Kind of a dumb move.
물 대출은 불가능합니다. 에너지 업하고 파워 업. 업그레이드 완료. 광맥이 바닥났습니다. 단월천이 바닥났다고요. 에너지 업하고 파워 업. 단월천이 부활됐습니다. 밥좀 먹고 이럽시다 광물이 없는데 자꾸 일만 시키나요? 습니다. 연구 완료. 광물 대출은 불가능합니다. He just couldn't stop shooting himself in the foot. He had the bigger army for uh, the entire game. But you can't just throw it away. No combat shield? Who didn't have combat shield? And how much would you like to bet? Twitch chat didn't have combat shield. Yes, Rico yes. boy, give them five subs to the people. Thank you for the generosity. Why did you lose your master? Dark has his own child now. <gasps> Thank you, Maverick, for 73 months. Go ahead, just don't go.
<laughs> Thank you, Caprellian. All right. Time for a, a quick... In order to take advantage of this scam train, we're going to take a quick advertising break. Um, uh, I'll be right back. Thank you, guys, for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Welcome. I know a lot of you out there uh, are thinking, is StarCraft 2 for me? Is this the choice I'm going to make playing the most stressful game, the most difficult 1v1? Um, and the answer is no, it's not. But that doesn't mean all of us have to uh, mean to abstain from such difficulties. Now, if you struggle, with spending your money in or out of game. If you struggle with contemplating ever hitting the ranked button, well, there's one struggle I think you can overcome, which is, of course, subscribing here and vicariously having those experiences through me. Watch me struggle in much the ways that you pretend you wouldn't. Watch me struggle as every race on the ladder and also the good ones like Terran. So, right now here today make the difference by subscribing thank you good luck and good night Thank you for sticking around. I know ads are loud and annoying, but they are mandatory. Thank you, Garion, for 90 months. I just still enjoy. How do you maintain your figure? Usually people subscribe instead of asking dumb questions in chat. Is how. Your dedication will be rewarded. Thank you, Lazy Turtle Strikes Back. For 23 months. Yeah, I just don't want to do it. What am I doing? This is crazy. This is crazy. In the rear with the gear. Bad news. I've been mining the gas. Fourteen years. Thank you, Race 121. But I just don't enjoy it. Ready. 
What's going on? Huh? Ah! Bad news. We're just gonna wait. Try to catch the first gateway unit. He shouldn't have seen the tech lab, so. Which should come across at about two. Well, this map, I think, is a little quicker. Stalkers is a strong maybe. Two stalkers plus a shield battery is a no. I'd rather maintain the Marauder count than trade. Stalkers don't get that much better in higher numbers. Classic 10 Marauder timing. I'm the co-op mission. Nope. Go away. <laughs> That's gonna be a no for me, dog. I completely fat fingered that one. His stalkers are right there. I like give between that, right? Yeah. The disrespect of the shield battery. But still, it kind of went horribly, so. Like, that was about as bad. Well, pulling the probes was actually a smart move, somewhat hilariously. 
I need those medevacs. Pretty sure he had a rubble bay somewhere. Yeah. Does he have double rubble colossi? Yep. Red! Okay, okay. I may need to pull the SC. Yeah, let's pull the boys. This is my best chance to fight. Five plus. No, it's not too true. That's a beast. Fight, fight. Not SCPs. I have like no marines, but... Battle... Boys. Six scouting colossus as well. Classic five tech lab. Never skip marauder day. Okay, now we gotta check for hidden bases because, uh, obviously here. What's going on? This better be good. You coward. How long on 2-2? Two, two? Eh. We should probably just go. Nice army. I'll take it. Right, it was pretty weird he wasn't going for the third for so long. It just dies. <laughs> God. Marauders, like, that. I love how shield batteries. It, like, there's so many things that just invalidate them. Like, I'm overcharged! Well, you can't overcharge if they get killed in a single volley. Doesn't really do anything. Ah. I'm playing Terran because I get frustrated when I don't play Terran. Because Zerg just get bu gets bullied on the ladder. Protoss has to play against Protoss. And that's terrible. And then... Unfortunately, there's not... This is kind of why, like, Zero Space's idea of the, the sub-factions is it lessens the chances of... Well, uh, if you make them all kind of equal. It lessens the chances of mirror matchups somewhat significantly. At the same time, though... Unfortunately, I've run the numbers. All right, what is my bias? My bias is uh, getting you to like and subscribe and getting as many views. And right now, that's mostly YouTube. Uh, more than Twitch. Though I still appreciate Twitch and YouTube streaming. But you know what gets... I've tried so many times. And I'll probably try again. But, like, you can clickbait as hard as, as you ever could have the best series ever and a mirror matchup of any kind tbt zvz pvp 
would be lucky to get as many views as like the worst non mirror matchup. Like if people just tune in and tune out, which is uh. Which is a bit of a shame because there are some great games there and if they show up, but like, it's just how it is. TVP is getting there too. Like, my big complaint with PvP for Terran versus Protoss is how polarizing it is. It's not necessarily imbalanced, though. It's just that you can't really fight and then it's pretty clear if somebody's won uh, very quickly. Which I think is not... There's actually... Uh, very, very rarely. Here's a, here's a behind the scenes. If I get past the uh, begging you for likes and subscribes on YouTube, there's like a 95% chance that uh, everything else is done live. Occasionally, I will um, find new creative ways to beg for likes and subscribes, and I'll restart. Those are behind the scenes. But recently... I've gotten like 30 minutes into TVP matches and just been like, no, no, these aren't good games for the fans. Like, gotta, this does not happen with uh, Zerg versus Terran uh, or Zerg versus Protoss lately, but like Clem versus Max Packs. Well, a lot of the, some of the Clem versus Max Packs matches I've just skipped. They're like 28 minutes long of Max Pax winning with Blink Stalkers or Clem making Protoss look sad. And it's Clem in the 28 minute game, one game. It's Max Pax winning three games in 28 minutes with Blink Stalkers. Not to take away from Max Pax, he is the best Protoss by far. Hero! Hero. hero <laughs> I think against anyone but Maru he'd have a better like hero wins plenty against everyone but Maru but like Maru is the best player in Korea when he wants to be and not even remotely close okay not remotely but like he's uh it really depends on if he's motivated it feels like, because there was like six months last year after Gamers 8 where like, and this is meant in the best and, and most positive possible way, where he lost to Scarlet in like round one of the GSL, like, and he just did like cookie cutter all in builds and Scarlet shut him down, which like, and then, and then Scarlet barely lost and he got out of the group now, so. Scarlet is washed up. Yeah. Who do you who do you think that is here washed up at 500 MMR higher than anyone else on the ladder? 400. I'll give you one guesses. You're like it's NA. How did no did anybody notice the cursor? I have a, I have a literally I need a sticky note, not a notepad. I need a sticky note to remind me to turn the cursor back down. Cuz uh when I cast, I turn the cursor off because what I noticed, and maybe I'm the only one, what I noticed, uh, is I get distracted by it. It's Scarlet, by the way. Also, she's working on zero space. How's Neeb doing? Neeb retired. Went back to school. I love the cursor. Uh, what a weird, what a weird world where it's like, I love seeing the cursor. Like, it could be anyone playing if you don't see the cursor. I think that's the difference between watching, that's the difference between watching replays and watching live, is you can actually see.
it is insane the disparity now the uh gentrification of the top of starcraft all right where essentially everyone who isn't dark clem max pax cyril maru maybe hero maybe rainer <laughs> like and then like you go you go to like nightmare versus shin which is like solid top 10 to 20 and it's so t <laughs> like it is it is the effective skill difference that between like diamond and silver except because they're so high up like the beyond make i beyond is in the depends on the day category like on the over there where it's like some days Oh yeah, he's done it. Look, the goat is back. So, Aligulac, the ranking site that everybody uh, says isn't like the be all end all, but there are no other ranking sites. So Cyril hasn't played a pro game in over two months. So he's been removed from the ratings because it's supposed to track like active pros. And because Cyril's going to military, um, and probably won't be playing till at least like DreamHack. That means he's no longer on the ranking. So here we are. Uh, Maru, rank one. He's not okay. So uh, he's got six months of effectively active duty, where he may be able to play in the large tournaments. Um, it's unclear. At least the the gamers eight probably. It's not clear on DreamHack. Uh, Dallas. Um, but also, oh, notice how everybody moved up a slot. I, I just noticed that everyone's moved up this week. <laughs> hmm. Why can't we track two months? It's not the most active game of all time. Also, we have so few pros. Also, esports is dead. Are you like an AI trained to parrot shitty Twitch chat comments? All right, you, you don't have to answer that. Um, but. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do a lot of spoilers, but in case you're wondering how many matches are played on average, um, today in StarCraft 2, this is today. How about this month? Wait, wait, wait. Why does it? No, no, wait, no, it's going a month back. I wanted to have a range. Yeah, there's an average of... Well, I'll just show you. So, I'm... This is the week of the finals. I don't know. When people stop clicking on StarCraft 2 finals, like 20% more than they click on the exact same series without finals in it, because it is technically correct. The ESL Cup, I'm just here to vent, okay? The ESL Cup finals, $400 prize pool every week. Three of them. So that's three days right there. Not every week has three finals that are worth casting, but a lot of them do, because guess what? Let's load up the replays. This is called the dark effect. All right. So if you look here, we only have uh, out of 15 replays, only four are dark, which is uh, remarkably low. Whereas here, if we go to NA, we have nearly 50% dark um, in this case. <laughs> Yeah, if we go back a week, we have... Wait, did Dark not play? Oh, he lost. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one doesn't count. All right, there's been weeks where it's like 60 to 80%. Oh, my God. Well, I guess that matches without Dark in them. There's only the finals. He plays in both. All right, all right, back one more. Where was Dark in this one? Was he asleep? 
Ah, here we are. Uh, out of 13 files, eight of them dark. Here we are. Oh, well, there's Hero as well. You know what? Now that I look at it, it's not as much dark as I thought. It's just he's more entertaining. I am always amused. It's like, for the North American Cup, who do we got in the finals this week? Dark, the Korean versus Max Pax. Dark on another computer pretending to be a Danish boy. <laughs> wow. And then the semi-finals were Max Pax versus Nightmare and Clem versus Nightmare was round of eight, so. The NA Cup. Which only means that they they play on NA if they can't decide on a server, and it's at a good time for North American play. <laughs> Literally not a single NA player. But what is the list right now? The best NA player is Estreo, who suffers from top-tier Protoss syndrome. Um, and by that I mean he's one of those Protoss players who plays... Correctly, all right? He plays very smart, and that's why he doesn't find a lot of success. Meanwhile, Hero plays like a at like a half-baked um, sort of like it's like he's on a fax machine sending in strategies sometimes, but but he's still up there because he knows how to he plays Protoss like a crazy person. And Max Pax is such a weird case. I don't know what we're going to do about Max Pax. It's such a weird spot to have your your number one Protoss being a Dark Templar. I feel like Nightmare is underrated here. I guess he doesn't have results in like major tournaments a lot. Nightmare feels low at 21. But he does struggle in like GSL. The top NA player is literally Estrella at rank 28. With special right behind him. And then Raynor is Protoss is 31. <laughs> Raynor, Raynor only needs to win one or two more series to be ranked higher as Protoss than any NA Protoss. <laughs> Was it Parting that came back that made a splash for a week then disappeared? Um, I mean, next season a GSL is coming up. Parting has been playing the other RTSs that are up and coming as well. Why do you think NA is so bad? I've talked about it before, but the support system isn't there. Like, especially... That's why half the pros have been Canadian in the past. <laughs> like, you can't really take a year off school in NA and be like, I'll just come back in a year. Like, whereas plenty of, of European players, essentially, they have the uh, social support systems. It is a bit, so it's different for Korea because of Brood War. It isn't as easy to, from my understanding, because like you have, it's weird because you have uh, the military service, which apparently most Koreans do when they're like early 20s because they want to, you know, get to their life. Which makes sense. It's kind of like going to school in, uh, like they sometimes they'll go before school. If they're going to go to school. Um, so, but a lot of the pro gamers put it off, which is kind of an awkward one, because obviously that's prime gaming years. It is a kind of unfortunate scenario. But there's also like Brood War League. Brood War was effectively the national sport of Korea. All right. It was on the same level as football. I don't care if it's freedom or non-freedom football. That should give you... It, it honestly still kind of is. So it, it's just a bit of a different thing. Whereas Europe, uh, once again, like, you can take, even if you 
Want to go to school later? School doesn't cost nearly as much. You probably have health insurance. Um, like, you're not risking your l possibly literal life by trying to play professional esports. And this carries over. Um, and by health insurance, I mean, you know, like, communism, right? Americans. Anyways, but, uh, which does help with pro gaming, apparently. This isn't just SC2. Can I get, I, you know what? I don't know for sure. Let me, let me see if I can find a ranking. I don't know where to find this, but top Counter-Strike players ranking. And you guys, I'm sure some of you can tell me if I'm on the wrong fucking site. HLTV, that sounds right. I think I've seen that before. All right. Communists are the best at esports because they got nothing to lose. It's actually the other way around. But, um... So, what do we got? France, Ukraine, Russia, 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 UK, Ukraine, Russia. Is that Malaysia? I'm not sure about that one. Uh, Turkey? No. And then Australia. Is that Australia? Australia. So find an NA, so find an NA player. <laughs> Is the... Um... Let's see, who's the number one NA... Wow, we have to scroll further than SC2. Which kind of makes sense because it's a team game, so it's unlike... Well, I think teams that have, like, mixed languages just end up speaking English, but... Uh... Well, who's the best American... Wrath. At rank. And I don't even know if this is, like, a good ranking, but... NACS is in a really bad state. Well, certainly the last... Five or so like that's the the infrastructure for esports is just not there like people like me who can monetize this shit and could do that from essentially like like you can be a good pro player and you can maybe win a tournament and you've won a tournament but the salaries and the prize money is not consistent if you don't win tournaments next year and you're trading all year and you're practicing then that's not as reliable as yelling at a screen about those players winning tournament. So, um, that is the reason why half the casters, or more, uh, are from NA, but almost none of the players are. <laughs> because there's a clear, even though it's a different medium, commentating sports is a tried and true profession. Um... So, uh, how about, okay, what's a, another League of Legends? League of Legends top players or teams, it doesn't really matter. Leagueofgraphs.com, that seems like the place. Actually, no, wait, rankings, best players. I don't think this is going to show me. These are just like ladder players. We want... I like League of Graphs as a name. I also enjoyed, if you saw the uh, League of Legends Vanguard, the anti-cheat article. I think that's the best PR Riot has done in a long time, is letting the uh, anti-cheat dude write that article. Um, those who read it know what I'm talking about. You know, I'll just, I'm just going to Liquipedia. We can look up the teams. Unlike SC2, where you can't really look up each individual player, but, like, the top eight teams are 40 players, right? So. Wait, is there no Liquipedia for League? What? That's crazy. That's not true. There's Rocket League. How about Rocket League? Rocket League? Sure. Let's see, let's see who are the best teams in the majors. Tournaments. Upcoming RLCS. Global rankings. Alright. Wait, wait, wait. 
there are qualifiers. I think we have to go to the last season and see who was at, like, cause, cause just like SC2, I think they have regions, but all right. All right. All right. All right. I haven't played this yet. Right. Right. Rocket League is an NA esport because of controller. World's region spots. So, I'm not entirely... Of the qualifiers, there are two NA, four EU, and one South America, and one I, I, Middle East, I think. And then a bunch of the NA got to wildcard, apparently. So... The winners were Team Vitality 4-0. That must have been a shitty Grand Finals. Since the games, they're French. Very French. And, you know, Fairy Peak. I, I've seen... Wait, is he the coach now? He was a player. You know, I bet he's washed up. He's, like, he's probably like 23 years old. 25. He's well past prime Rocket Leaguing age. Let's see. How about Zen here? 17. 20. And the captain, 20. Yeah, honestly, Rocket League, I think, requires more reaction time than Counter-Strike. Because Counter-Strike, you know, at least within a certain range, where the enemy is going to be a lot of the time. You can plan for that. But Rocket League is all just Twitch reaction all the time. It's the entire game. All right, who did they beat? Team BDS. What does that stand for? And they're Swiss. Um, Monkey Moon. Uh, how old is Monkey Moon? 21. When did he pick his name? <laughs> Carmine Core. French again. What is that? I don't know what flag that is. Morocco. So, borderline French. Oh, don't don't say that. Okay. Are they, they have two coaches. They have a coach and a performance coach. Team Liquid. How about Team Li Good old Team Liquid. Oh, that's not NA. I don't Portugal. Poland. The average viewers of the ROCS was 148,000. I say that Rocket League is one of the top esports, just like as a spectator sport. Partially because it's just everybody can understand it. But they do a great job on the production as well. Compare that to SC2, where the average. Like, for I Am Katowice, I'd be surprised if the average viewers were over 50k. Like, that seems to be for the tournament, not just the finals, so... That is actually quite a... Like... You know, I am a little jealous, because on Twitch, they have un uncapped bitrate. Because Rocket League is a game that you need that. You need so... Like, the max bitrate on Twitch. Not on YouTube. YouTube, you're watching me browse... Liquipedia at full 1440p, but it's capped at 8k on Twitch, which is not capable of even full 1080p during games like Rocket League. But RLCS has like 50k bitrate. I mean, obviously they have a special deal with Twitch, but that's why it looks so good. Because they actually have the bandwidth. Anyway, so my point being, I'm trying to find an eSport that Americans are good in, and Call of Duty isn't a real eSport, so... I guess... How about Overwatch? Alright, Overwatch, which... We kind of gave up on being a thing. I'm pretty sure Overwatch is just super popular in Japan now. Halo. Heh. <laughs> All right, all right. So. Used to be Dota 2. Oh, yeah, Dota. How about Dota? Maybe. 
We can rage with the best of them. Completed. Tier 1 tournament, Dream League. Let's see it. Spoilers, by the way. Team Falcons. Versus Bet Boom. Um, Saudi Arabia. Uh, wait, no, those aren't the players. The players... Wait, the owner is from... Sa yeah, well, that, that tracks... Slovakia, Russia, Jordan. Hey, look! But led by an American. I'm, I'm, I'm taking it. We did it, America. Russian team. But the captain is from Moldova. Extreme gaming. Really? 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 Chinese. Really? Like... Uh, extreme. Oh, oh, not as good. Not as good as gaming gladiators. Team GG. Looks like Team One Win couldn't even get that. Oh yeah, yeah. I forget we had good game gaming in SC2. So yeah, that wasn't. We're not. We're not immune. Well, so the summary is, NA good at talk, bad at eSport. You said Valorant? Wait, do they have a Liquipedia Valorant page? Would we win Valorant? Like any? And I do attribute it entirely, not entirely, but significantly to cultural differences. And by cultural differences, I mean not screwing the rest of your life over by taking two years off, like, when you should be going to college. All right, all right, one more. What, what is the tournament that they just won? I, I don't see any A-tier tournaments recently. Oh my God. Has more tournaments than SC2? It's like an NA qualifier. <laughs> Masters Madrid. Maybe, maybe it was like more than a couple weeks ago. Masters Madrid 2024. There you go. Yeah, yeah, it was like three weeks ago. What's the prize pool? $500,000. I mean, remember, teams, but... Ooh, looks pretty good. 3-2 finals. And, I mean... We got three-fifths of the team. All right. Three out of five from NA. And then we also have Steph Curry here subbing in. Um, that's clearly who that is. <laughs> uh, whenever you need a ringer. He hits all the shots. But, uh, good for them. What is this? Oh, they don't have... Ah, Normies. Director of Esports. They don't even have screen names. Esports has really taken another turn. What was I looking up? Oh, yeah. Just to give you an example of how many SC2 tournaments there are real quick. If we're listing everything here. So 
so here are the upcoming tournaments, which, you know, that does include all the ESL weeklies and all that. Here's what's going on right now. Here's what happened in the last few weeks. So, yeah. In case you're wondering why there are so many finals. Well, there you go. Are those are these real or just over versus mode? What? A four K? Are they co-op speed runs? Time for... Good game gaming. It is called Versus, alright? Technically. Like, because cause PvP doesn't explain anything. Like, you say PvP, and that's already misleading. Like, oh, we're going to play PvP. Protoss was... I wish Ladder had more PvP. Have you tried being a European Grandmaster? It's time for the community cast. We're going to ca cast a couple... I accidentally closed the game. Accidentally. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's doing the fake update. Uh, if you got some games, send me the Got Replays channel. Is it all esports versus? I'm trying to think if there's any that are more... Um... Like co-op, PvP, or... There's always competition. There's no tournaments that are based around like speedruns or something. We need more Bronze League heroes? Well, for every diamond in the rough, metaphorically, there's a lot of coal. Competitive Tetris, which, uh... Now we're waiting for SC2 to pretend to update, which it's lying, there is no update. Or not even worrying about the damn cyclone. You can shut down Battle.net and restart, which just pushes the problem down the line. Delete your cache. <laughs> Do I need to download more RAM after that? Or is that supposed to be before? I know sometimes you can launch it while it restarts, but sometimes it doesn't work. Because, um, it hates people. You know, all right, 
I kind of killed my own motivation. We're back to planet crafting. The games, I want to say they were good. I did not play well tonight. It wasn't terrible, but I didn't want to perpetuate horrible habits. Um, is why we kind of bowed out of the uh, ladder games pretty quick. I was making too many of the uh, macro mistakes that are are problematic. But Planet Crafter is a remarkably clunky for... Anyways, we have rockets. So... But thank you for watching that, I see too. We'll be back uh, tomorrow night. I do plan on doing some more casting during the stream. Not, not a lot, but occasionally, because otherwise my voice, um, I'm, I've gotten, as I get older, it's not that I get better at anything. I just get better at managing it, which is fucking boring, but also effective. Um, so we're going to play some Planet Crafter. If you're on the YouTubes, the stream will restart and it'll look even like we're going to be gathering so many minerals and then we're going to put those minerals in boxes we're going to use them to make rockets and those rockets are going to flirt with asteroids and those asteroids will try to hit on me or hit me more literally so yeah that's how the game works